When you have more columns of data than can be viewed on the screen, Excel data form provides a convenient means to enter or display one complete row of information in a range or table without scrolling horizontally. To add the form button to the quick access toolbar, do the following. Go to File. Options. Select Quick Access Toolbar on the Excel Options panel. Click the arrow next to the Quick Access Toolbar. In the Choose Commands from box, click Commands not in the ribbon. And then select the Form button in the list. Click Add, and then click OK. In the Worksheet with Multiple Columns Data Table, press Form button in the Quick Access Toolbar to activate Excel Data Entry Form. The data form lists the column headings as labels at left and reads data for each column of a selected row to enter the data to text boxes adjacent to each label. The text boxes allow to edit data. You can enter new rows, find rows by navigating, or, based on cell contents, update rows and delete rows. Command buttons are laid out at right of the dialog to implement intended functions. Add a new row of data. In the data form, click New. In the data form that appears, type the data for the new row in the fields provided. To move to the next field in the row, press Tab. To move to the previous field, press Shift plus Tab. After you have finished typing data, press Enter to save your changes and add the row to the bottom of the range or table. Before you press enter, you can undo any changes by clicking restore in the data form. Any data that you have typed in the fields is discarded. Find a row by navigating. Do one or more of the following. To move through rows one at a time, use the scroll bar arrows in the data form. To move through ten rows at a time, click the scroll bar in the area between the arrows. To move to the next row in the range or table, click Find Next. To move to the previous row in the range or table, click Find Previous. Find a row by entering Search Criteria. Click Criteria, and then enter the Comparison Criteria in the data form. All items that begin with the Comparison Criteria are filtered. Change data in a row. Find the row that you want to change. Change the data in the row. To move to the next field in the row, press Tab. To move to the previous field, press Shift plus Tab. After you finish changing data, press Enter to update the row. Excel automatically moves to the next row. Delete a row. In the data form, find the row that you want to delete. Click Delete. Close data form. To close the data form and return to the worksheet, click Close in the data form. Excel Data Entry Form is an excellent data management tool especially for the data table with many columns. Still I could point out some aspects to be improved through this discussion. Excel Data Entry Form is a modal dialog box. You are not able to work with all Excel functions while the modal dialog box is active. You can enter data for each column, up to a maximum of 32 columns. Row selection on the dialog is not in sync with row selection in the worksheet in terms of visibility. Dialog box height is variable with the number of columns and will be maximum to window height, making worksheet data are covered by the large dialog box. We will discuss how to resolve the limitations in a separate discussion.